Hello guys and welcome to this, just a really quick video from me and Cover Song Sunday is going to be back next week I haven't had time to record anything today so I'm just going to literally spam this one out do something a little bit funny since the last video was quite serious thank you for all the comments that I've received on that so far it really does mean a great deal if you haven't checked it out, check it below there's going to be a lot of changes in here but anyway, I just thought today I'd do something a little bit different so let's get on to it Right, as always, I've recorded this for about 20 minutes and noticed that I didn't even press the start recording button. So yeah, I'm already 20 minutes into something that you'll never get to hear. But I just thought I'd do a video of you learning a little bit more about me and from the happiest sides, just random questions. So today I'm going to be doing something called either.io, uh, which is a what do you rather. And yeah, so you get to learn a little bit about me. So we're going there right now. And this is the first one that came up. And so I'm just going to go through a fair few of these. I'm going to try and get about five minutes worth, uh, unless any good ones come up. And yeah, we'll take it from there. So, all right. If you had to have one in your bedroom, would you rather have a complete stranger that cuddles with you or have non-stop screaming seven-year-olds? I would much rather have a complete stranger that cuddles with me. I can't think of anything worse than just having a screaming seven-year-old or many of them over and over and over again screaming at you. I'd rather just somebody that would just cuddle you and shut up and that would be the end of it. So yeah, that one settles that. A fair few people agree with me now. <laughs> would you rather have all your limbs cut off by a very dull butter knife or have to go to every single local WNBA game for the rest of your life? I have a no idea what a WNBA game is, so if you want to enlighten me in the comments you can, but I'd much prefer that to then getting all my limbs cut off by a dull butter knife. So yes, I'm definitely going to be doing that. 85% agree. I, who is this 15% that want to have all the limbs cut off? I just don't get it. Like, I really don't get people. Would you rather be starving for the rest of your life or obese for the rest of your life? Funny story this one. If you click in the top right hand corner about now, you will see that there's a video of me saying that I'm sorry. That I am trying to lose weight. I am trying my best to do it. Go and check it out. And I don't want to be obese though, so I'll rather be starving. At least you've got water, right? That's a close one, man. Now, would you rather eat a rancid mixture of rotten egg and old fish or bathe naked and vomit? These aren't video ideas, by the way, because I would not <laughs> I would not do either of these. I hate the smell of fish anyway. It makes me gag. And there's a, an idea for you. But to bathe naked and vomit, that also makes me sick. I'm like nearly already like, ugh. But uh, yeah, I'd much prefer to bathe naked and vomit than eat that. So yeah, that's, that's a lot closer than what I thought it would be. Depends if you like fish, I guess. Anyway, watch a movie directed by, would you rather, James Cameron or Steven Spielberg? I'm a massive Spielberg fan because I pretty much grew up when he was like really, really big doing amazing things. But James Cameron is also awesome at the moment. And so I'm going to go Spielberg just because of my age. But uh, yeah, that was a hard one. Would you rather work a minimum wage job for the rest of your life or live in the wilderness for the rest of your life? Or without a job? Right, let's see what it says here. If you choose a job, you kind of quit and find a better one. It must be in the same place forever. You will receive a raise. If you choose to live in the woods, you can't ever return to society, although you can bring someone with you. Both has its pros and cons. I mean, I would love to eventually move to the countryside, but that's not living in the wilderness. I don't think I could literally just hide away and that would be it. So I think definitely going to go for work a minimum wage job for the rest of my life. And as long as it's a job that you're happy with, that should be okay. But I can't believe how close that is. You guys are mad. Right. Would you rather never have a relationship last longer than two years or be a spouse of a polygamist? We were watching something on telly that was actually following a polygamy family. Is that how you say it? Like, and then um, it's very interesting, but I just don't understand how you can have four wives and have time to do stuff with all of them, with all the families and that. I just don't understand it. That might be me just being a boomer, I guess, but no, uh, I just couldn't be, like, be a spouse because then it would kind of be ingrained in you. But at the same time, never having a relationship last longer than two years. In the situation that I would be in, I'd rather lose friendships because you can always regain them than be a spouse of a polygamist. So yeah, I'm going to go with that one. I knew that one would be close. Scared past that one. Right, would you rather lick the armpit of a sweaty cab driver or eat the earwax of an old woman who has never cleaned his ears? What? What is it with you guys? Why do you even come up with these? Again, this is not a YouTube video idea. I will not do this. 
But if I had to pick one of them, I'd definitely pick lick the armpit of a sweaty cab driver over eating the wax of somebody else. That sounds pretty disgusting. And I'm glad 88% agree with me. 12% you're just weird people. Very weird people. And would you rather give up Christmas or give up your birthday? And me personally, Christmas is family for me. Like we do a lot of family things on Christmas. And giving up my birthday is fine. I don't want to know how old I am anymore. And so yeah, I think giving up my birthday would be the way that I would go. Because otherwise it's there's a good reason to catch up with everyone around Christmas. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna go giving up my birthday. It's still very close. Wow. Right, would you rather be male or be female? I'm just gonna go male because I am and I kinda think that I'm good at it, so I don't wanna change. I may be wrong. <laughs> What am I, what am I even saying? What am I doing? Would you rather soil yourself and have nobody know or not soil yourself but everyone thinks you did? I'd much prefer not to soil myself. Funny enough, because I'd imagine that that would be pretty uncomfortable. I wouldn't mind if I walked like I shot myself, that would mean it was a good workout at the gym. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna go with. What, you'd rather, what, why, why? Am I missing something here? Like, why would 75% of the people happily soil themselves and then just think, oh, well, nobody knows about it. Well, what world do we live in? <laughs> Would you rather be a content failure or be an unhappy success? And I'd rather be a content failure. I think being unhappy is like a major downfall, but I honestly think being content is the best way to be. Like, fair enough, you've got more to aim at and all the rest of it, but yeah, I would too. I think I'd rather be content than unhappy. So that's what I'm going with. It was a hard one though, and yeah, I can see why that would be so close. Would you rather have ice breath or have fire breath? I'd much prefer ice breath, because I love drinks when they're freezing cold, and fancy being able to do that, just get... <sighs> ah, that'll do. I, I think that'll be the best thing. So yeah, I'm going to go ice breath. I just don't want to meet the person that's got fire breath, because then it would be pointless. Would you rather fight a wolf with your bare hands, or fight a large bear with a sword? See, you're learning a lot about me today. Useless information. I would much prefer to fight a bear with a sword, because with my bare hands, I would not last a second against a wolf. At least if I've got a sword, I've got some kind of protection. Yes, it's bigger, but you can chop a legs off with a sword. You can't really chop your legs off with bare hands. So yeah, I'm gonna go with that one. Would you rather cut off your right hand or cut off your left hand? Cut off neither would be nice, but if I had to pick one, it would have to be my right hand. Funny thing is, is as I play guitar, uh, I've seen a couple of bands uh, have a hook for a hand, uh, as this hand, obviously not for this hand, unless you play a lot of slide stuff, you might be all right. But yeah, definitely would be my right hand. Would mean that I wouldn't be able to do certain things, or I'd have to relearn, if I was a teenager that is, right? Who got a right hand? Would you rather go to heaven or hell, or be reborn into a better or worse life? And I think I'd rather be reborn, I think, the reason behind it is that heaven to hell all would depend on your life before anyway. So being reborn meant that you could effectively change the things that you'd either done bad or, or whatever in a life before. So yeah, I think being reborn is a good way to do that. So yeah, that's where I'm going. Would you rather always wear a top hat or always wear a giant cock necklace? <laughs> <laughs> Just noticed that I've said the wrong word. So I'm just laughing at myself there. Would I rather always wear a top hat or always wear a giant clock necklace? I'd always wear a top hat. I love wearing hats anyway. So yeah, top hat for me. Fancy walking around with, with a top hat all the time. That'd be great. I'd love that. Anyway. To let out your anger, would you rather smash a computer with a baseball bat or smash a guitar on the floor? Nobody's touching these babies. Nobody at all is touching these. Beautiful things that's in the background here. I'm definitely gonna go computer. I don't know how I would then go and do stuff for you guys. Why is 53% people saying that smashing a guitar on the floor? If it was bass, fair enough. Not a guitar though. Not a guitar. Never a guitar. Would you rather be an unknown superhero or a famous villain? I personally would be an unknown superhero. I think I like the whole vigilante thing. I think it works for me. And so yeah, that, that's who I would choose. I'd be Batman. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I would definitely be an unknown superhero, so I'm gonna go with that one. And, and I am gonna leave it there, guys. Again, thank you so much for watching these. And uh, leave comments underneath on any that you do agree with or disagree with. 
It'd be great to hear from you as always. And if you are new here and you've enjoyed it, press that subscribe button. Remember to press like. It does help a great deal. If you haven't enjoyed the content, press the dislike. Again, it still helps. Cover Song Sunday will return on next Sunday. I just, as I said at the beginning, I just haven't had time today. Wanted to put something out for you guys though, so this is why I've recorded this. And yeah, I'll see you during the week.